Good morning, Sound Squad! Mr. Sound here, bringing you some more VGC 2017 Battle Spot Ranked Live. Still using the Vanilla X team, but we made a slight change. We got rid of that Crocodile for Hariyama, and let me explain why real quick while I choose my team here. Basically, I wasn't getting Tailwind up enough, and I wasn't applying pressure with the Tailwind, so... And I also, like... I'm not a big fan of Kukudai, it doesn't do enough damage, so I went with Hariyama, and why Hariyama? One, he has Fake Out, two, he still Oko is Muck, three, still does a lot of damage to Porygon 2s, and, um, that's honestly why I went Hariyama here. Uh, I think it's a great mod, we're rocking an Adam and Nature instead of Brave, so he has 70 speed instead of 49, and then tell him that's 140, that should be good enough in most situations. Right now, against this team, I think I'm gonna lead my Hariyama, then we're gonna go... Ooh, Hariyama. Hariyama Vanilla sounds pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. Let's do that. We'll break my own sturdy if I can bring you. Hariyama, Vanilla, Arcanine, and. Do I need Finny? Not really. Do I need Bravey Ari? Uh, I'll bring Finny just in case. That's gonna be our T1 right there, guys. So. If you're excited for some VGC Battle Spot ranked live on the channel, show some love to the like button. And guys, here we go. We went 2-1 yesterday. Today, I want to be 3-0. So, with that being said, guys, here we go. Of course, the heater comes on as soon as I start recording. But hey, man, it is what it is. I don't think it's that bothersome. I've never seen any of you guys complain about it. So, I do apologize if you do here. But anyway, here we go. Celesteela and Muck out and about. It's a shiny Muck. Hariyama Vanellux making their way to the party as well. There they are. I'm probably going to fake out that. Uh, I think I'm going to fake out the Muck so I can kill with close combat next turn. And then turn Vanellux into the... Uh, fake out the Muck and then turn you into Arcanine, I believe. Just threaten that Celesteela. And if it's physical, lower your attack. So... Bringing in the Arcanine right now. Vanellix ain't doing too much, so we're gonna get rid of Vanellix for now. Bring in the Arcanine, lower both their attacks. Mostly gonna matter on that Muck. Hyrima fakes out that Muck, so we're gonna worry about any knockoffs this turn. And then next turn, I close combat and kill it, most likely. Does Celestia get Trick Room? I freaking hope not. Big fake out damage. It's a crit. Neg one heavy slam going off on the Arcanine. Ain't gonna do jack. And that is very, very, very nice to see. Turn one right there, my friends. CC into the Muck slot. Flare Blitz into the Celesteela slot. Hail hitting everybody. And that is going to be turn two in a nutshell. Muck is lower to die to close combat with the Flimmer Boost. After this, Hail hits me, of course. Lefties revealed on Celesteela. Is it substall? I don't know. We'll find out once I get burnt right here. Good, good, good. No more statuses for me. Fight. I wonder, this Finny's... I just realized this Finny's, um... Terrain prevent Flamebolt from working? That's a good question to know right now. I really want to know what, uh, what the case is there. Alright, we got two Adamant Mons ready to go. It's going to go Arcanine, Celesteela, Hariyama, Muck most likely. Unless, even if Celesteela's uh, quiet nature or brave nature, I think his low speed is 75. So I will be going second. Alright. No Flamebolt today, but that should be a dead mark. The power of close combat Maka. I mean, close combat Flamber Pariyama. He's faster than me? What the hell is that Muck's speed? Oh my goodness. All right. Well, Muck is dead at least. But still. What the heck, fam? And that was a neg one knockoff. Was that a crit? I didn't even realize why. What's going on right now? Why was he faster? That really sucks. I'm in trouble now. Celesteel is still a neg one. I'm about to switch out Hariyama because of the Negwin defenses, but at least we killed the Muck. But I did not expect that at all. I gotta save the Arcanine. I, I can't afford to uh, to lose him. I need him for that Celesteela. And it's gonna be tough. I mean, close combat and Blizzard probably take it out, but still. Oh, man. That is not good. That was very unexpected. Also, there's a speed tie. Because I think Muck and Hariyama have, uh, have both the same speed. So I guess you're we both like adamant instead of him being brave or something. Wow, that really sucked. Lost my berry and everything. Oh, all right, who's coming in here? Probably Garchop, I'd say. If Garchop comes in, I gotta go into 
let, let Arcanine drop and Blizzard close combat to Celesteela. That's what I gotta do. If Garchomp doesn't come in, I don't know what I'm gonna do because I forgot what your team is. So we'll see what happens turn uh, turn four or whatever the turn it is gonna be. Gastrodon it is. All right, I have Frieza for you on deck, so that forces me not to Blizzard anymore. All right, let's uh, close combat and Flare Blitz and Celesteela. Just get that out of the way. You can't protect this turn. I mean, he could, but I definitely outspeed Gastrodon with the Hariyama, so I should be okay with close combat going off. And the Flare Blitz and Celesteela is going to be in neutral because he's half steel, half flying. So close combat is indeed uh, neutral instead of weak or resisted. And, uh, what? Scared? I thought there was someone scared the house. I thought someone was right there. It was just a shadow from the outside. It scared me. All right. Let's see. Celestine might chat if he does. Someone's taking big damage. I don't think anybody's just steal off. I'm fighting on your team. So I should be okay with this turn right here. Uh, good thing Arcanine would speed Celesteela. But, I think he's gonna die here. Maybe Hariyama will, because he's gonna be at neg two. He goes to the double. Thank God. Okay. He doesn't get it. Flip goes off. Can this kill you? Probably not. I'm going to recoil no matter what. It's not gonna kill. I should have gone for Gashadon because... He's going to die to the hail. All right, he does live, unfortunately. Celesteela is going to die here, but I'm going to take a, basically a plus two skull. That crit does not matter. Defense is be dropping, and it might be a tie game right now. Skull goes off. Can I live one at next two? I might be able to. Oh, there we go. Not bad. This and they got one more turn to me. We got one more turn that I can close combat that Gashadon. Hopefully, it doesn't have Protect. I might be getting a free, uh, what do you call it right now? Uh, let's bring in Vanellix. Actually, let's bring in Finny so I can reset my hail eventually if I have to. Let's bring in Finny right now. Let's see if Gashadon has Protect, Recover, Scald, Ice Beam. Chomp indeed comes in. There he is, fam. There he is. I'm just going to close combat the uh, Gashadon with the uh, Hariyama. And Finny's going to do Finny things. Close combat Gashadon. I'm probably going to die to EQ here. You might protect EQ. Hmm. That's fine if you do. I'm going to calm on. Actually, in case you go Swords Dance, let's just Moonblast and Chomp. Let's just do that. Make sure we're not, uh... Yeah. So if you protect EQ here. If you EQ, it's five. If you Swords Dance, it's a problem. That's why I'm going for Moonblast here. If you go Swords Dance, I could lose this game. So I don't want that happening. I want to be able to uh, kill this guard so I can freeze dry the Gashadon. As I think an EQ protect is inevitable for my opponent here. Otherwise, uh, he kills Hariyama. So you can't do Jack to Finny. You know that. Oh, 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 oh. That's a problem. I mean, they ain't going to do much. But good thing I went for Poison. I mean, for Moonblast here. Over Calm Minds. All right, we're gonna get an attack on that on that Gashadon. Very nice. Moonblast gonna do just over half. CC goes off on that Gashadon. Is it dead? It might be dead. It is, and that is the power of Hariyama, guys. Oh my lord, what a champion Hariyama is. He's gonna go down and out here, but his job was well done. Took down the Muck, took down the Gashadon, and game uh game uh one looking in my favor right now. Even if you have a Scarf Chomp, you like the Poison Jab. I live with Finny. I destroy you with the, um... I destroy you with my Vanellix. And that's gonna be game one going to us, fam. Beautiful. Vanellix, come on over, baby. Come on over, Mr. Vanellix. We only got one turn of hell left. So, obviously, we're just gonna freeze dry, play it safe. Show you that I had it for the Gashadon, so I get mad. And then Moonblast for the game as well. You're probably going to forfeit right here, but... I mean, you might try to EQ because you think you're fast me, but you're not because I'm scarfed. Boom! My boy Vanellix. Let's go. Yep. Freeze Dry goes off, and that is a wrap for Garchomp. GG, my friend. Game 1 goes to us. We're looking good. Hariyama looking like a very nice addition to this team. And like I said, Fake Out Turbo was beautiful. Killed Muck. Killed Gashadon. And guess what Kukudai couldn't do? Kill Gashadon. Kill the, uh... Kill the, uh... I just, I just accidentally flipped you guys off. And kill the, uh... I mean, he could've, he could've killed the Muck. Would've wasted his E-move. But, eh. 
it is what it is. And also, our Zubu op opens up to only Braviary, which means I don't gotta debate who's I wanna use. So, that's a solid game one right there, guys. Let's go. Let's go, baby. Continue battle. And that was a solid game one. I'm feeling good. Feeling real good. Let's put on some Team Skull right now. Three and one record right now. Go back against our man Liguria from Italy. What do you got in your squad right here, my friends? You got the Lilligan Torkoal. You have the Chomp Laylee. You have the Slowbro Muck. High ammo is going to be a must for that Muck. You might only answer for Muck, basically. Probably going to leave with you as well so I can fake out um, any potential Lilligan Torkoal sleep powders. And then I want to cover both the Slowbro and the Lilligans. Who could do that for me? Really, no one. Magnus a Flash Cannon, T Bolt, but like. I don't think that's enough, my friends. And then you could also switch in the Laylee. So you know what? I'm not even not even go Hariyama. Alright, Lilligan. We're gonna go Hariyama and Magnazone, because Magnazone covers both the Slowbro and the Laylee a little bit. Then it might be gonna magnet rise up also. We'll see. Hariyama, Magnazone, um uh, Vanellux. Hmm. Could also get rid of your weather and get rid of looking like, speed. That's always an option. And I'm gonna go Finny. And that's gonna be our game two team. Is it the same exact team? No, we, we dropped uh we dropped uh Arcanine from Magnazone. So here we go, guys. We are risking fake out turn one, being blocked. But we gotta see what your lead is. I might just go for a heart attack. I don't know, actually, what I'm gonna do here. Alright, here we go, my man. My man, Stee. My man, Stee, what do you got? We see a Magnazone Hariyama come out. And. Laylee slow, bro. So no fake out here. Maybe force the heavy send that Laylee, which is fine by me, honestly. Would you trick room? I don't know if you would. Oh, man. Switch defense rises. That is a beefy slow, bro. All right. I wonder if you would Psyche MZ my Hariyama. Or Psychic. If I was you, you're not going to go trick room, I don't think. Because you think my team is slow. That's what you think. So what I'm going to do here is protect Hariyama. And... Flash Cannon, the Laylee. Slowbro really can't do much right now. If you protect, I'm going to scream. Alright, so far, I think I am as long as I protect it because you're pretty slow right now. Let's see here. Say so it goes off. Ain't going to work. Flash Cannon's turn on that Laylee. Is that big damage? Oh, it's not enough to kill, damn it. Alright, Chicken goes up, so I is going to go for Heavy Slam. Then I might I might die to slow bro though. He's definitely gonna psychic here. We're gonna bring in the Finny. And then Magnazone takes out the Laylee or should I magnet rise? Let's get Laylee out of here. We'll magnet rise when we can. Because we are the chop is gonna be slower than Magnazone, so that's fine by me. Bring in the Finny right now. Get rid of your terrain. Make your psychics do less. Do you protect psychic here? Like I basically did last term. Protect lately psychic slow, bro. Let's find out. Size shock. Gotta do a lot less than psychic because I'm bold and bulky. Hell yeah, Finny. Good job. Flash cannon. Nope. Goodbye to that lately. That's a thing of beauty right there. That's a free KO. Interesting trick for my opponent turn one. Don't know why you would do that. But pays off. No more terrain. Fake as in a, as in as in uh is on deck. Feeling good, yo. We feeling good. If you bring in Chomp, I got Magnet Rise, and I am slower than you, so you better watch out. Circle! Oh, Circle! Oh, Circle, you are a redonkulous Pokemon for me to fight against right now. All right. I think I just set up Calm Mods with Finny. And Magnazone uh, might end up dying, unfortunately. But we'll still alternate trick room and go for protect the calm mind here. You might celebrate Finny if you do. Fine by me, honestly. 
Uh, right eruption goes off. How much are you gonna do the Finny? I'm kind of bulky. I know the sun is up. I resist it. How much you got in that tank? Oh, we're fine. We're fine, yo. We fine. Sasha goes off. Ain't gonna do jack to Magda's own combine. There we go. And now I'm probably gonna protect again with the Finny. Get some HP back. Because I'm gonna need it. And then I think Magazone's gonna say Sayonara right now. I'm gonna try to attack the, uh... I'm gonna try to attack that Slowbro, maybe? My opponent's team... I don't know if I need Magazone anymore. I don't know if I do. So yeah, we're gonna try to, uh... T-Bolt. Because Slowbro really can't do anything to these Pokemon here. And I could kill Slowbro with uh, Freeze Dries. But just in case, I will go for a T-Bolt here on that Slowbro. Finny protects. Here comes an Eruption. And that will be the sturdy Magnezone going off here. But I think Slowbro might do the job and finish me off. Wiki Berry though, so maybe I get a little bit of juice in the tank. We'll see. Should have gone for this. I uh, should have gone for the Torque one though, honestly. That's all right. Side shock. I'm gonna do Jack. And we get a free Tebow. He's that plus one. Yeah, I should have for Torque. I messed up. I messed up. I messed up. Hmm. But now I can protect with the Magnezone. And I'm going to try to scold the Torkoal. Because we have a... Oh, last turn I took him. Hell yeah, dude. Let's go. Let's go. Scold that Torkoal. And protect Magnezone. I don't care if the sun's up. It's going to do more than Moonblast no matter what. So, my boy Magnezone. Way to be, dude. Sturdy Magnezone. Proving to be a worthy adversary right now. Eruption ain't going to do jack there. It's going to do another, like, 60 to my Finny. Not even because I got the combine up, I forgot. Slack off. Ooh, okay. He's slack off slow, bro. It's plus one. That's fine. I'm gonna get some damage from this Torkoal right here. And then I trick him's gone, so. I'm gonna hit that slow, bro, next turn. Skull, you do well by half. Alright, good. Eruption damage ain't gonna do much anymore at all. I've got to double team slow, bro, here. Moonblast. I could just kill Torkoal, though. He might, he might protect, though. Moonblast t both. If you go Eruption, so be it. If you go Protect Eruption, so be it. Fix up doesn't have a, a Protect, though. Up, up, up. Here comes Chomp. Yeah. Well, Garchomp might die to the plus one Moonblast. We'll find out. Torkoal does protect. So this is a great turn for me. Even though t ball ain't gonna work, I do get the Moonblast off. Alright, Moonblast at plus one. Chomp is gone. A beautiful KO right there. I'm honestly surprised they killed him one shot, but you know what? We take it. He's gone. And this game two is looking pretty solid for us, fam. All right, terrain is gone. Sun's going to be gone very soon as well. Uh, uh. And Slowbro lost his plus one, so T-Bolt will kill it now. And we got to bother with that. So he just scold and... Uh, yeah, we, I think we got the game in the bag now. Scold Torkoal. T-Bolt the slow bro. Mm -mm. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's game. He can't do anything here. Killing that lady e early turn one was beautiful. Or turn two, basically. Alright, so that slow bro plus one is gone. And Torko follows suit. Game two going to us, baby. Good job, squad. Good friggin' job. Not bad at all. Alright, game three now, fam. Game three, baby. Game three. Hmm. Alright. Let's see here. Uh did I did I use I didn't use Baby R at all yet, guys. So you know what? We might I might just use him game three for the hell of it if I, if I if it's viable. I mean if not if it's viable, but I might just use it because I want to use him. But it's alright. Let's see. Continue battling. Alright, finding the opponent like right now would be awesome. Nice and quick, nice and quick. 
Nice and quick put some Guzma on so you can feel good about ourselves. Celebrate my man Guzma. Let's see what we got going on right now. Here we go. We got a man from Kanagawa, Japan with a squad of Coco Raichu, Weavile, the Gashodon, Arcanine, and the uh, Porygon Sue. I don't think I could go Breviary with this squad. You got a faster fake out. You got two electric, two huge electric mons for me. This is going to be a tough matchup. This is going to be a tough matchup. All right, we're going to go Hayayama. And we're going to go Vanellix. We're going to go Finny to maybe lower the terrain. And we're going to go... Probably Magnus so I have a switch to resist electricity. And that is gonna be our game three team right there. We need we need we need our we need to kill Muck with the Hariyama. I'm working with Hariyama. We need to like oh it's gonna be a tough game, man. It was gonna be a tough game. Finny, Vanellux. We get Vanellux Hariyama lead. It's gonna be a tough one, man. It's gonna be a tough one. Hopefully we don't go with Weavile and somebody else. I wanna see Raichu and then Coco. So I get a free fake out. But if you go Weavile, it's gonna be tough. Coco Raichu, beautiful. You still have a faster fake out though. So you're gonna be forced to fake out my heart. Yeah, I'm here thinking I'm gonna go for a fake out. And as you do, I just blizzard. But I might single target that. I might go freeze you have a blizzard or something here. I might. Alright, we're gonna fake out Raichu. And blizzard. That's what we're going to do. Fake out on the... On my harmony, like I said, he's going to take the bait here. Beautiful. Here comes a blizzard! Took the bait. He took the bait. He took the bait. There's a lot more to the Coco than this than Raichu. What the heck? Is that a bulky Raichu? What is that? Can I bring in my terrain? I might double switch here. Then you're just going to get right back up. I want to lower Raichu's speed. Aw. Uh. Right, your speed is doubled. Mine's 1.5. You're faster than me. Arcanine comes in. Lowers on Hariyama's attack. Yeah, I got a double here. I got a double here. Get some hail damage, hail damage off on the right shoe. Alright. Uh. Hmm. Being at neg one right now is not the best situation. So we're going to turn... Hey, I'm into Magnezone, and we're going to turn Vanellix into Finny. So if you go for that like, Gigavolt, you go for the Raichu and Z, I can't get paralyzed. Even though you would target the Magnezone most likely, the Magnezone slot most likely, you can't get paralyzed anyway. But just in case, double switch going off here, bringing my Finny, lower that Raichu speed for next turn. And then the next one, Hariyama is going to turn into my Magnezone. Hopefully you just go Flare Blitz Psychic like I think you do. And that should be okay. E-Speed. Hmm, did more than I thought it would. Volt Switch as well. Uh, Finny's looking uh, pretty mediocre right now, to be honest. That sucks. Double team that Vanellix, but why? Why the double team on Vanellix? That's what I want to know. Coco comes right back in. Hmm. I'm going to lose my own stutter, which is really bad, because I could have used it right now. Could have definitely used it. Would have got a free T-Bolt off. Could have killed the Coco. Oh, man. This is really bad, guys. This is really bad. This is really bad. I'm going to try to T-Bolt Arcanine. And Finny will protect here. It's not looking good, fam. It's not looking good right here, honestly. Arcanine's out. Is that Raichu coming in? Porygon 2's coming in. It's going to catch a fat T-Bolt in the terrain. It's going to trace 30. That's fine by me. I don't care about that at all. 
Coco protects. Very interesting turn. My opponent's part. He's giving me a chance right now. Hell yeah, let's go. Let's freaking go. Alright. Tebow goes up on that port. I should do about half, I'd say, to the terrain. Ooh, and the hell damage? You know what? Porygon 2 is threatened now. I know your whole team. Porygon, Raichu, Coco, and the Arcanine. One more Tebow. The thing is gone, man. That thing is gone. Na -na 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 -na. You know, it can't be trick him here. I'm going to Tebow at the Coco slot. And then I'm going to go for a... Come on, the Finny, because he's dead anyway. I could go for double protect, but it ain't going to happen. So, it is what it is. False switch goes off. Goodbye, Finny. And let's Tebow the Arcanine or the Raichu that's coming in. That's what I really care about. If it's Arcanine, he's gone. That's going to be huge. It's going to be a huge KO. Please be Arcanine. Please be Arcanine. Please be Arcanine. All right, at least we, kill, we might kill the Raichu between the Hail and the T-Bolt and the Terrain. Not enough. Not enough. Could have killed Porygon instead. But then he would have brought Coco right back out. It would have been bad. So it's fine with Porygon being there. Do another turn of Hail? Do I have another turn of Hail? If I have another turn of Hail, I'll be okay here. Uh, question is, do I bring in Hariyama and force the Raichu to fake out? We're bringing Vanellux. I can't outspeed. I bring in Hariyama because he can protect, I think. And then Raichu is going to die to the uh, T-Bolt I go for. Why is that Raichu so bulky? What the fluff? All right, we're down to the last turn of Hail. So Taylor going to do Jack here. I got to kill the Raichu. Hmm. All right, T-Bolt, Raichu. Hariyama is going to protect. Let's do that. Let's do that. We have damage to Porygon. Porygon should die to a close combat flame orb. But the same thing the thing is, you still have that stupid ass Arcanine. Uh, it's gonna be tough. It is gonna be tough to win this guys. It's gonna be very tough. Protect goes off. Please fake out the Hariyama. Please fake out the Hariyama. Electro Ball. It's gonna do a lot because you're so much faster than me. I could have gone for that. I could have gone for the Porygon here. All right, let's see what Porygon does. He thinks he's fast. I mean, Shadow Ball goes off. Shadow Ball. This kills me. Be so upset. Good. Wiki Bear goes off. We are back in decent shape now. All right, here comes the Arcanine. Hell stops. I honestly gotta get damage on the Arcanine. We still have Coco as well. So we're we gonna do here. Uh, uh, last turn of the terrain. Arcanine comes in, yeah. Uh, I think I protect Magnazone in close combat to Arcanine. Only real choice I have. Protect Magnazone. Close combat at the Arcanine. Or I double team it and predict, you just predict that. Because you did that last time. Hmm. Now we'll play it safe. We'll go for close combat in the arc and I, I believe in Hariyama. I believe in Hariyama! I believe in Hariyama. Okay, good. Play it safe so far, so good. Close combat goes. Oh, you're faster than me, huh? Wow, so wh what? what is this guy's team? This is so weird. Close combat goes off on the arc and I'm. Please! The Intimidate saves his life. Fluff! Intimidate saves his life. Mm. I 
I'm pretty sure a blizzard will kill him now. So I'm going to... T-Bolt, Arcanine, and close combat the Porygon Sue. So I can kill with Blizzard, hopefully, on both of them. Flare Blitz goes off on the... Right, he's going to die to Recoil. He's going to die to Recoil, which is fine by me. And then can I live a Shadow Ball Neg 1? I should. He's going to live. That's fine. I should have the Shadow Ball. Yes, I do. Defense, I don't care. I'm already at like neg 5,000. Alright. I don't think it's enough to kill you with the Blizzard. I don't think it is. But Blizzard and Hail damage might be enough. So, how am I hang in there, baby? Killing that Raichu is huge, honestly. We're bringing a Vanellix or a Scarf. We're gonna, but he has E speed. I should live one E speed. I should live one E speed. Alright, there he is, fam. There he is. Get the hell back up. And we definitely go for Blizzard here. Hopefully it's enough to kill the Porygon. Blizzard and close combat. Porygon. You, I know you e speed the Vanellix. I should live that though. There's no reason why e-speed should kill Vanellix. There's no reason at all. There's no reason at all. I'm surprised Porygon has to use Hariyama. That ruins everything. Arcanine's out of here? I don't know why you would do that. I don't know why you would do that. You just gave me free kills. Why would you do- I guess he didn't realize I was Scarfed? I don't know. Alright, goodbye Coco. And Porygon, baby! We're gonna go 3-0 today, fam! We going 3-0 today, fam! Oh, man. That extra damage for Vanellox over 9 times was very crucial right there. Killed that Porygon. Let's pour a speed message. I don't know what that was. Either way. You're going to e-speed Hariyama, I guess? Game's in the bag. Game is in the bag, fam. That was a weird switch. I don't know why. That we got That was a huge win. Yo. That was a huge win right now, my friends. Oh, my lord. Huge. We got the game guaranteed. She was like guaranteed, but I think we got the game. Uh, hell kills us both no matter what. All right, I think I think the double attacking is fine here, even if it protects. E speed goes off. Then Elk should live this. He doesn't. Oh my goodness! Wow, good thing I uh, I double attacked there. Jesus, that was bad. Wow, if he e speeded last turn, that kill. Oh, man. It could have been really bad. Well, we get the game, baby. We go 3-0. Talent squad, thank you for watching. As always, you've been a wonderful, amazing audience. If you enjoyed this episode of VGC Battle Spot Ranked Live, show some love to that like button down below. Don't forget to subscribe as well. And, guys, enjoy your day. I'm in here for now. Catch you later. And we will see you next time, my friends.